HIV patients in Uganda will no longer need a cocktail of drugs to fight the virus. A single dose pill has been launched by the country's government to treat those with HIV. It's a great innovation. Antiretroviral therapy started when there was a heap of pills. Patients will now be taking one tablet a day with even more efficacy, and that is what we must do. Uganda was one of the first African countries to respond aggressively to the HIV AIDS epidemic. The one pill a day drug is much cheaper than other treatments, costing just $13 a month. Uganda is falling short on a national target to ensure that 80% of people who need antiretroviral therapy have access to it by the end of this year. James Mukasa is one of just a few in remote areas of Uganda with access to medicines. He says any new developments in HIV treatment would help many affected by the disease. If there were trial medicines for treatment, it would be even better. I would give myself in for testing. That would help many of us and other people. It is estimated there are 1.4 million people now living with HIV in Uganda and around 600,000 of them are not yet receiving treatment. Allowing better access to antiretroviral treatment for those who urgently need it is still one of the most pressing challenges. We have to monitor the treatment to make sure that 90% are virally suppressed, which means we have to do very lot. All of these are going to cost a lot of money. If we do that by 2020, by 2030, the epidemic would be normal. The Ministry of Health has increased its antiretroviral treatment eligibility, so adults are receiving treatment much earlier. The development of a single-dose medicine, which can be picked up in a pharmacy, has been hailed as one of the biggest achievements in the treatment of HIV. However, experts believe that far more work needs to be done to prevent the contraction of new infections. Leon Senyange, CCTV, Kampala.